Forza Horizon 5 just recently dropped for the Xbox and it looks fantastic. Microsoft also created a special controller and Razer created a limited edition charging stand to pair with it. Today, we're gonna pop them both open and take a look. We've unboxed some fantastic special edition controllers and chargers on this channel. The question is, can this set live up? Also, for you deadheads out there, Microsoft might have buried an Easter egg on this controller, but I'll let you decide. And there we have it. To begin with, we have a translucent yellow plastic that makes up the bulk of the faceplate, which has hot pink and blue splatters, which go with the buttons, which have blue letters on pink field. The menu and the options buttons are blue with pink accents. The share button is white with a pink accent. And then a the D-pad is white, which is actually more of a pearlescent color because you can see there is a slight shine there. The left thumbstick is blue and the right thumbstick is pink. On the back, we can look that we do have the Horizon marking logo. It's not just a regular white plastic back. We have black dimpled plastic along with the controller grips, which these are even different than the other plastic controller grips we've had in previous special edition controllers. In comparison, you can see the texture here that we have on the Aqua Shift controller. It even feels different. This feels almost like a fake leather steering wheel. Transparent design. See the rumble motor and lighting effects. Share button. Capture and share content seamlessly. Xbox wireless and Bluetooth. Easily pair and switch devices. Custom dimple grips. Inspired by a race car steering wheel. It does indicate that it lights up, so let's go ahead and Pop some batteries in here and see what it looks like. The thumbsticks have good action. That's a really nice pearl coat there. And this was one thing I wasn't expecting. We also have alternating colors for the triggers here. Inside the box, we also get a set of instructions, product registration guide, and a game add-on for Forza Horizon. This is a really great looking controller overall. Next up, we have the charging stand for Razer. We have the translucent yellow plastic all along the front and on the top here. On the back, we have the white plastic with a port for the USB-C charging cord. And the front is stamped Forza Horizon 5 in white lettering. And then we have blue, purple, and pink splatters across the front. Wouldn't necessarily call that perfect, but I'd call that super close. Additionally, inside the package, we have one USB-A to USB-C cord. As always, we have the nice green razor accent. We have one replacement backplate. The only unfortunate thing about this is we do have a special backplate that has the Horizon logo on it. And we lose that with this one because this is just a standard white. Now this does actually come with a backplate for the Xbox Series controllers and the Xbox One controllers. And that's because you don't have to just use this Forza charger with a Forza controller. And then we have one battery pack. This charging stand clocks in at $49.99, which is about $10 more than the standard Razer Quick Charge stations, which are $39.99. But if you already have the Forza Horizon Special Edition controller, you might as well splurge that extra $10 and get yourself the best. It's not going anywhere. We have one more to add to the collection. Now the question is, will it make me better at Forza? And I guess the answer to that question is no. I'm Rob, thanks for watching, and remember if you enjoyed this video or found value from it, make sure to hit that like button and consider subscribing. I'll see you next time. Thanks to all my subscribers and a special shout out to all the community members.